Hey, Rift. So what do you think? I am pretty excited about this new overlay. Picking up right where we left off. I did go back to town a little bit and swap out some of my Pokemon, but now I've got my team set up. I and mean, that's all I really did was come go do that and come right back. But yes, I'm happy I, I got this made the other day, and I, I think it looks great. I am excited to have a new overlay. As you can see along the top, uh, over on the above my head here. I've got a little trainer and all the chibis of my current party above my head. All wiggling around above me. So let's get this on the road. Let's see what we get. I've got this already. I need to rearrange, I forgot. I gotta put somebody weak in the front so I can level them a little bit. And how's the volume? Is it a little bit too loud for me, or pretty normal? Feels like it might have got reset, so I might need to change it. Yeah, it's pretty dumb looking. Its evolved form isn't much better, honestly. Good to know. Good to know. Gotta start leveling my growth zone because I like it. Hey! S'more. I want this. If I remember correctly, this is a steel bug, which, it means, which is why I want it. Well now, bro. It's an ant called S'more. Yeah. I think it has two evolutions as well. Heck, I might even go back to town and switch him into my party, because I like him. Oh, it's just a bug. Maybe it's Evolution Steel Bug that I'm remembering wrong. If a s'more approaches your picnic, it's tr not trying to steal your food, it just wants attention. Still, some people are afraid of them. I knew it was a, uh, a picnic theme going on there. Yeah, I'm gonna go grab him out of the box. After I fight this lady, I guess. It's a lass! Oh no, it's a picnicker. That makes sense, actually. Oh god. Fortrug is so ugly. But it's the ugly cute. Yeah, exactly. Like, I like the idea that bug Pokemon level faster and everything, but yeah, they're too weak sometimes. True. It's kind of like the three-stage birds that are in every game. Including this one. I actually think there's two three-stage birds in this game. Not 
poison. Sizor, especially if you go to Scizor. I love Scizor. Scyther was okay, but Scizor was so much better. Whoa, the ant knows fire. I would get poisoned in the first fight. That's not what I meant to claim. No! Why is it faster than me? That's the one thing I will say for this game, is it, it's a lot less forgiving than, uh, the actual, like, mainline Pokemon games, because this one is designed knowing it's a, an adult audience. I might have to go back onto the other, uh, route and level up more before I continue for work, because these trainer fights are just not gonna work with my current stuff. My Raptorch does fine, but if he gets beat up at all, it's like, well, good luck with that. There we go, burn the bug. Yeah, we got rid of the picnic, and now we can get back to town. <laughs> I did too, but like, I'm, this honestly isn't that far into the game yet. I've only beaten one gym so far, but this game, like I said, it's a lot less forgiving than the real mainline games. It throws you deep into it. I plan to keep the uh, the sprites above me up to date each time I start a new stream. So I'll change them out to the new the current party every time. Hey, I finally did something useful, I guess. Not sure it's low enough, but I need to get it done before I get poisoned to death. Also includes fairy type. 
So it uses mostly stuff from Emerald Era, but it does throw in some little things from other stuff. I don't know if I want to keep both of these two or not. Mm. Cubbug's cute though. I don't I remember what its evolution looks like, but it's like a teddy bear mixed with a bug. I think I'll keep the rest of these for now. Try and level them up some. I know I want to level up Grozard and S'more, for sure. And of course Raptorch. Like I said, this is going to be pretty short, though, because sadly I had to go out and do some stuff before I could get to the stream, so... I got other things coming up later, I won't be able to stay at streaming very long, but... Nonetheless, I hope... I'm hoping to just kind of do some little stuff that I needed to do. Like level up some of these Pokémon. Like beating up little things. Yeah, exactly. I didn't I didn't care for its existence in the first place either, but I'm not gonna make a big stink about it. It's like they can do whatever they want with their their IP. I think it's a dumb choice, but hey. There are more better types they could have added that needed to exist more, so like I'm glad Dark and stuff like that came first though, I will say. <laughs> Dark was a good inclusion. There's still too many normal type Pokemon that feel like they should be part of some new type. Oh, the Gardevoirs are on Fairy type too, don't forget. I don't know if uh, Gallade is, but I know the rest of them are, I think. Smash this chip up. Yeah, Steel was also very good. Right? Those were the days. Steel was king. Alright, so there we go. We got my girls had like three levels and just doing that. Between the fight before and beating up some ch chin monks. Stop calling me. 
and people calling me on my Pokepod. I still think it's weird you can't fish out front here. really weird the steel resisted ghost, honestly. <laughs> Can't wait to get an EXP share so I don't have to deal with all this nonsense. I hate the whole switching thing to gain XP and thing all that fun stuff. One of my least favorite parts of the game. in the first hit. because the game thinks it's nighttime right now, because I mean, it is technically, I guess, nighttime. too long since I actually played to remember all the, the weaknesses of the more abstract types. Like I said, it's just been a long time since I played a Pokemon game. The uh, last one I played was Black. And not Black 2, just Black. This is getting old now. Can you stop? Thank you, Mankey. No, stop. Jesus. was honestly a disappointment. It was too damn short. Yeah. 
that's fair. I, I didn't actually buy the games, I just borrowed them from a friend, because the only reason I even had the machine to play them on is because he gave me his old one when he bought the 3DS. Too. Experience is good. I'll have more chances to catch a light hand. Since he appears right there, it seems. It's this house. I'm just gonna take this off your desk, it's fine. I actually like this area of the beach. That's about as much time as I can do with this today, but this was fun. I forgot a little bit. I got some leveling done that I needed to do. I pro I might even jump onto the game at some point between the two for next week and do some more leveling on my lower level Pokemon just to do it off screen because it's kind of boring. I'm sure you don't really care to watch it that much. Because I'm not, I'm not going to continue forward. I'm going to go backwards and just fight weaker stuff. And then next time around, we'll see where we're at. If not, I'll just continue on the beach because the beach. Either way, this has been fun. Um, I'm gonna host somebody after this, so if you want to watch them, I'll be over there modding for their stream, but that's why I have to get going, because I'm modding. That's job. Anyways, keep your torches lit, delve deep, and keep rolling.